Hey there, true believers. Ring is argue with more. Let's play Vampire the Masquerade of Lines Blind. The last time, we blew up a building, and now we're to go meet the prince. But if we're gonna go downtown, we have some stuff we can go to. Um, the downtown's got apartments, so we can go hang out. We can go catch this mud guy. Can't do that, really. We can go do the explosive beginning, which is the main quest, I guess. And the regent's riddle. I don't know what that means, but we can certainly go there. Where to? Um... Mm, just drive, I suppose. We'll go to downtown, because that's what we need to do. Awesome. This is going to be great. I'm going to love downtown. Let's drain it. Let's take it and leave it out for the sunrise. We're going to have a lot of fun with this one. Think you could blow up our warehouse and get away with it? Ah, huh, Nick. <laughs> Let's blow out its eyes and its tongue and its teeth. I want its teeth. Camarilla fuck. Boys, I think we could all use a little entertainment. Those of you sitting in the first few rows will get wet. Son of a bitch! Oh, okay. Not dead. That's good. Hey! Leave. There's three of us, Rodriguez. Yeah. <laughs> three of us. What are you gonna do? Shoot us? This ain't over. We'll find you. You too, Rodriguez. You're both dead. Nobody messes with a sabat and lives. Keep moving. Well, oh. trouble sure seems to like you. Yeah, you no idea. Good effort. Execution needs a little work. You look like shit. Yeah, I was names nines. Hit with a bat. Um. Well, thank you. You made me not die. Should have been more careful, newbie. Bunch of shovel heads like that. They walk tough, but they scare easy. Just tear an ear off or something. I'll keep that in mind, then. Wait, you were the guy from the beginning of the game, weren't you? Kid, I got things to deal with. Why don't you pay me a visit at the last round tonight? I don't know what you've heard so far, but it's time you heard the real story. You know what? I would love to hear the real story, Nines. This is a mean existence. Stay out of trouble, kid. Yeah, I... I got the idea there, Nines. I've already been beaten with a bat and threatened to be killed by crazy... Crazy vampire people. I hate tonight. I hate tonight. Dumpster. There's no one nearby me, but I hate tonight. Alright. Ow. Downtown's different. <laughs> and the award for most astute observation goes to... Hmm, can't go in there. Don't think I like this place. Okay, those cool looking gargoyles though. Wonder if those are actually gargoyles or just uh hey, gang members. Let's not mess with them. Nocturne. It's a theater, that's that's pretty cool. It's closed though, so that sucks. Aha! The apartments. I need to go in here. Where am I going? It's, uh, 2A. What? No, you want 12A next door. Uh, 
employees only. Okay, don't want to piss off any of the locals. Elevator is in use. It was 2A. Yes, it was. Okay. Imagine that's 4-2 then. Because, you know, 2 it makes sense. And A means it's the uh, first... Ah. Or the, alternatively, the only room on 4-2. Expect a blood buff just in case I'm not good enough for this. Mr. Melton, you know who this is, and I do hope you realize that we're still on for tonight. Meet me at the agreed upon location across from the bar by the underpass. Bring your associate, Mr. Durbin, as it is a two-man job that I am proposing. With any luck, the two of you are already on your way, and I shall see you soon. Goodbye. Hmm. Guess I know where I'm going. No, it's not a thing I can pick up. There's a vent I can go in, though. So maybe this guy's already out of his apartment. These are, like, really... This is a really scummy place, though. Like, no joke. I could throw his guitar around if I so chose. I'm not going to, because that would be immature. There's a vent in here, too. And clothes are just a brick model. Ow. <laughs> Fine, then. I don't want to go out there anyway. Alright, let's keep sneaking in case he comes home. I don't think he will at this point, but still, I'd rather be safe than sorry. So, with us having that done, now I do believe it is time to uh, go and talk to our boss. Is it the ground level? See, I don't, I don't know if the, uh, I don't know if this is, this is European. Oh, it is European. Okay. Fair enough then, because in Europe the ground floor is is the main floor, and the first floor is this is the first floor off the ground. It's very very strange. It makes sense though. I can't say it's wrong. Empire Arms Hotels. All right. There's a cop there, so let's assume I can't be going that direction. Not near your stuff. That, that, that place was called Confession. I feel I'm gonna have to go there at some point, but we should probably go in here since this building seems important. Probably where our boss is situated and where he'll probably want to hear from us an, an hour ago. Well, unfortunately he's going to have to wait until I find the entrance because, well, there is a... Apparently, only one way into this building, and the way that I wanted to go is not that way. What the hell? They're not... Okay! Let's just pretend I didn't see that. Apparently, there's murder going on around here. Aren't coming at me. <laughs> Why are the goons just killing people? <laughs> this is very strange. Very strange place. I don't like it here. I was taking a swing at me. This is the this is the front gate. Is that not the place I need to go? But it has to. It's the it's like the biggest, most impressive building here. at the Venture Tower downtown. This has to be Venture Tower. Unless this is Venture Tower. Which it might be, since I can actually go inside here. Hmm, yeah, it says LaCroix. This must be it. Oh, it's you again. Hey there, Chief. Small world, huh? 
Yep, after that gallery, I, I didn't think I'd be able to get a job guarding a room full of jack squat from the boogity man. <laughs> but then I get a call offering me this sweet night shift slot, and I'm back in a security game. Ah, well, uh, enough about my lucky break. You, uh, here to see one of the big leagues, Chief? Uh, yeah, actually. Would that be Sebastian LaCroix of the LaCroix Foundation, or Dwayne LaCroix of Insurrection Baby Formula Company? Um, I'm guessing Sebastian. Uh, okay then. Mr. LaCroix, he told me to expect someone fitting your description sometime tonight. You go right on up. Thank you. Yeah, uh, you have a good power meeting, or, uh, whatever it is you types do up there. Do you need any security? Well, you just ring the front desk and ask for Officer Chunk. That's me, in case you were wondering. <laughs> I will not be... Uh, yeah, right, good. Bye. Oh, what a strange fat man. Oh, alright. Where am I? Oh, yep. <laughs> So let's take the only elevator here, then. To the penthouse. Oh. Hello. It's tall, dark, and buster sword wielding. There you are. I was informed of your presence in the building. Since you're here, I'll take the liberty of assuming you've destroyed the warehouse. This is correct, yes? Uh, yes it is. Most excellent. I had no doubt you'd prove my decision a prudent one. I trust you encountered no impediments to your progress on account of my personnel. Hmm. You know what? Let's... Yeah, nothing. That is the answer I like to hear. You've done well, circumstances being what they were. I will admit, not many in your position would have overcome such a trial. But don't misunderstand me. It was no fool's errand. You may yet prove to be a genuine asset. It's a bit disturbing the lack of talent within this organization as of late. Tell me, what would you say to doing a bit of reconnaissance for me? I think I'm going to uh, have to do it anyway, but I'll be polite. Yes, sir. Excellent. Were you by chance in the military at all? I was an officer myself, actually. In Napoleon's ranks. There have been whispers, rumors spreading around the Kindred community concerning the Elizabeth Dane, the cargo ship that was towed into port recently. Have you heard of it? Um, can't say I have. The Dane was found out at sea. The reports say it was without crew, but they have yet to report a fate of said crew. The police are investigating the Dane as we speak. Even the Nosferatu have little information on what's been found, However, the reason the ship has caused such speculation is because it was transporting an object called the Ankaran Sarcophagus. Now, I'm not one to predicate a decision based on conjecture, so what I need is fact. And more importantly, I need evidence that the occurrences on the Dane were not supernatural in nature, and in no way relate to this Ankaran Sarcophagus. Alright, um, what do you need me to do, I guess? You have three objectives. One, I want you to examine the sarcophagus for anything unusual. You may sense something peculiar about the sarcophagus. In fact, many kindred in the city have reported an uneasiness in the air since the Dane's arrival. Do not, under any circumstances, open the Ankaran sarcophagus. Secondly, the police have begun their investigation. Find out what they have concluded thus far. Thirdly, take the cargo manifest for the ship I want to find out what else it was carrying. The last thing we want is police aware of our existence, so be careful what you do in front of them. And unlike the warehouse, you cannot wholesale slaughter a ship full of lawmen without consequences. Is this understood? Uh, yes. Good. Oh, and it has come to my attention that you had an encounter with Nines Rodriguez earlier. The man so does love to throw that cretinous charm of his brashly about. What exactly did Mr. Rodriguez say? Um, well, it, I guess just to meet him. I see. Then, you should go humor the by-the-numbers rhetoric he's so desperately aching to spew. Oh, please, before the chance of fascist oppressor from that dive of theirs clog the air and choke the local kind. Uh, sure. 
Give the Anarch community my regards. Okay. What's up, dude? Don't want to talk? Cool. Good talk. Oh, back at the front desk. That's cool. That saved me a lot of walking. That was nice of the game. So, the prince is kind of a dick. That's fine. He's the prince. So, fine. I guess if anyone's going to be a dick to me, I'd rather have it be him, since, you know, he is... Hmm. Hey! Player, what's the score? How they hang? Good evening and all that commotion. Welcome to Fat Larry's Trucker Mac, the only store for all your needs after 10 o'clock. I am the proprietor and salesman of the month several years in a row. The ladies call me, oh God, but you can call me Fat Larry with a F-A-T, because I know I got a weight problem. I just don't give a fuck. Okay. Ah. <laughs> uh... Cool. Um, are you in your store, then? Now, that is a legitimate question, but a better question to be, what don't I got in this truck? Because at Fat Larry's, my motto is, everything's got a price, but I probably know somebody who can get it anyway. Uh, okay. Nah, now that's what I like to hear. But it's like this. I say my best stuff for select clientele. Now, that don't mean I don't appreciate your badness. It's just, you know, badness. Fine. What an incredibly strange man. Uh, nice. I'm definitely gonna pick that up. I do, I, I do have a shotgun, don't I? No, I can't sell that. Fine. Guess I won't then. It's all those car stereos though, and that ring. Mm. Probably can't use that. Don't wanna buy the arm? Fine. No one wants to buy the arm. Ah, there we go. What do I look like now? Cool. I I'm wearing a hat and a thick jacket. Good. I am the most equipped. Partner. Yeah, I don't need anything. Goodbye, okay, fat black guy. That's all I got out of him. He's a fat black man. That's fine. That's all I needed to have gotten. It's a plus-sized black man. Can't go in that door, it's just painted on. Is there a homeless colony back here? Well, if I need to, I have a place to get blood. That's cool. Alright, let's, uh, let's not hang out back here. There's a cop there. I don't. Would you stop coughing into my let's play? It'd be awesome if you moved your fat bum ass out of my way. Thank you. I look like one of you. Well, I guess one of the many versions of you. Anyway, this is what I'm gonna call the set. Um, we talked to the prince and did some stuff. I don't think we got, you know, we, uh, we didn't get really an EXP. That's, that's fine. Oh, I've lost all of my other quests. Oh, because I'm not done yet. Let's <laughs> the bar. Well, we'll work on that stuff, but until next time, I hope you guys had fun, so I'll see you tomorrow with more Let's Play Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines Blind. So until then, until then, Rain K.